Well, I decided to put the uh, tires and wheels on it. I'm waiting for some parts for this thing. The carburetor showed up, but it came damaged. It didn't work. I'm also waiting on parts for the uh, for the duster. This thing's almost ready to run. A couple other things, and I'll have it ready. So, I've been waiting on some parts. They didn't show up today. This is the other duster. But the satellite, I decided to put the wheels on today. This evening. At least get something done. And there we have it. I'll put the other two on. Same process. Nothing out of the ordinary. Oh yeah. I'm liking it more and more each day. Well, this is what it looks like. I shot video at night, but I didn't change the settings on the camera for night for night video. But so following morning, this is what it looks like. I think it's gonna look really nice once I put the the striping back on it. Put some striping around here. I don't know something. Whatever the pinstriper wants to do, it's gonna get painted anyway it did have a tape white you know two stripe tape all the way across so just a quick recap you know with the new tires wheels i think those hubcaps look really good I mean, it just it gives it that muscle car look That's what was on here. Those are off of the 64 Polara. These have the big 10 inch or 10 and a quarter inch uh, center. So I got another video to shoot on that car. But there it is. Hopefully I'll have it running this weekend. The front tires are 215 7015s on a 7 inch stock wheel. The rears are 255 7015 on an 8 inch 4.5 inch backspace. This is the parchment uh, original interior, original color. There's a couple slight cracks on the dash there, but I guess for its year, for its years, its age, it's actually in very good condition. I did change the carpet about five years ago. Oh, and it is a uh, factory sunroof car. I'm gonna get that uh, headliner piece fixed again I guess I have this piece here that little tab broke there take that off and put the new one on but it is a factory console there is no shifter on the on the column A nice cruiser I did put new uh, new shocks front and back change the springs the original springs were sagging a little bit so I put I had a set of e-body springs I put on there they fit fine the fronts 
All I did was change the uh, the shocks. Went to like a, a gasmatic, gas charged shock. I don't know if that makes any difference or not, but we'll see. As always, again, thanks for watching. If you like this video, comment, like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day.